This playthrough is rated E10+. Greetings and salutations, loyal fans. Voldemar back here with another action-packed episode of LEGO Marvel Avengers. In the last episode, we stepped back through time and encountered the beginning scenes of the original Avengers back in 2012. And now, uh, Loki, the trickster god, has taken the Tesseract for his own. The, the, the Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. must chase after him. But the door locked behind us! How could he lock the door? Oh, what a... But a truly trickerous god he is. So we must find a way out. So, as Maria Hill and some generic uh, shield agent called Agent Williams will figure out a way to get out of here. So. Alright, so a lot of this stuff we can't even really do or mess with because uh, we don't have those characters. That's if we want to replay through old levels again as those characters. Okay, so we need, uh, we need to find a way to get to that switch. Okay, well, let's see what our options are. Can we rebuild the that back up? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Do we have any? Are they? Okay. We have some dudes there. Are they? Oh, are they people we can switch to? No, they're just there to help us. Okay. That's fine. Good great grand. Yeah, I don't remember to pay attention to in this game, like, a lot of uh, visual cues, like, uh, you know, stuff that can be rebuilt and, and so forth and so on. Okay, can't, can't go through that fire because, uh... uh hello? Okay. Oh, did they die or something like that? We need to... Okay, nope. Alright, so we needed to... I guess do we need to jump up here, maybe? Or can I shoot it? Okay. Oh, is that her special ability, is just to summon dudes? Huh, okay, that makes sense. That's interesting, but that makes sense. Okay, what does that say? Okay, just cut to make a shield. Hit those switches. Yeah, gotcha, okay. that with her little key card. Access granted. Okay, so what is that going to do? Oh, turn on the fire alarms. Okay, so now we can get to that what's ever in that fire. Perhaps uh, some clue we need, or perhaps we need to uh, rebuild the, uh, yep, we need to rebuild. Hold on, before we go on, let me see what's over here. Oh, that's for vision to go through. Okay, so I can't do anything with that. Gotcha. No, I know what to do, game. Thanks. But 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 thanks. Okay, let's put together this vehicle. Now we've got Voila. Just need some firepower. Oh convenient that got destroyed in the in the process. Okay, let's see what this unlocks. Yes, it is me, Maria Hill. I am totally awesome. Actually, like I said, I haven't read much of the comic. Uh, like, I I like the idea of the comics. I like the characters from the comics, but I haven't actually real. I'm not a religious comic book reader. The only comics I usually read are whoa. The only comic books I really read are like the big old graphic novels or the unique like one time type of things, like uh, like Watchmen and stuff like that. And even then, I'm not. I usually tend to read just standard books more. Not that I have anything against comics, just uh, you know, just that just seems to be what uh. Um, type of stuff I'm just mainly into. Okay, so we need to chase after that fool who uh, crashed open with the uh, that bike, so let's add that to our little vehicle. Gotta have more oh, horsepower. Is this issue? <laughs> Isn't this breaking at least five health and safety rules? I think with the current situation at hand, I think we are uh, we can uh, accept... Oh, it's a uh, I wonder how you actually get it. Oh, I bet. Oh, I bet you need Thor's like um, hammer too, and let that be up there. Stand the man. He's stuck inside that. But we can't do that with these character with these current characters. All right, come on, Wilson. Let's get this thing started. Let's get this started now. Let's get it started Let's in here. Let's see how strong those shutters really are.
This is Hill. I'm in direct pursuit. Do we have clearance to shoot? I repeat, do we have clearance to shoot? Oh, now we have to get... No, come back here, collectible. We need you. Okay, so we just move back and forth and press X to... Uh... Okay, there we go. Got it. Got it. Yes. Got it. Want it. Got to get it. I guess we're, ah, oh man, having to, having to uh, take out shield agents because this is a Lego game. We're not, we're not, we're not, we're finishing them off. We're taking them out. We're not actually uh, killing them. Okay. We got it. Well, looks like they're not really fighting back, so do I need to, I guess I just need to keep shooting uh, missiles at them. And... Man, shield must be really sp uh, decked out. They've got infinite missiles. We're playing to Loki. Dang it, Loki. Okay, so. Can I switch to... No idea how to use this thing. Wait, I thought you were okay. a field agent. Just aim, lock on, and shoot. Okay, so yeah, just uh, hold Y down and shoot. Take him out. Lock him up, lock him up, lock him up. Sorry, just shoot out the tires. Up, oh. up. Oh. Yeah, the thing about the thing about if you did a straight adaptation for the movies, it'd probably be a bit shorter, at least in game form. So you have to add like extra, extra like people or areas, and I'm fine with that in game form, as long as it adds to the initial feel of the movie or, or whatever the material they're taking off of. Gotcha now, Hawkeye and Loki. All right. Fa yeah, far their their ability to use banana peels has uh, prevented us from uh, effective control. All right. Man. Good thing when people get controlled, they they become infinitely stupider. So you can so it's easy to take them out. Man, where is this place? In, where is Shield's headquarters anyway? It's it's a be underground like many miles but they've got plenty of uh, roadway to mess with here. Well, all paid on the American taxpayer, am I right? Tesseract is with a hostile force. Hill? A lot of men still under. Don't know how many survivors. Down to general call. I want every living soul not working rescue looking for that briefcase. Roger that. As of right now, we are at war. A Loki entrance. Level complete. All right, now we can play free mode if we wanted to. Yeah, I didn't collect as much during that uh, during that run of uh, of it, but you know, like I said, I'll replay it off screen and collect all the studs and everything. I don't want to take forever doing tasks like that, you know, because I generally want to play the story, you know. So, you know, we got we got uh, we got the Avenger original Avengers movie of Hawkeye and Locke and Agent Williams. Sorry, Stan didn't save you that time, but uh, we'll try we'll try in uh, replay mode. We got a couple of the unlock rooms. Very nice. And didn't collect all that. Most of the stuff is just to unlock other characters for replay anyway. So, anyway, with uh, with Loki having gotten away with a, tech or a Tesseract, it looks like uh, S.H.I.E.L.D. has uh, some priorities on hand. And they need to figure out how to uh, stop this mad god of trickery with uh, this infinite power source. Or at least that's what they believe it to be, or some type of key. So let's continue the story and see what we can find out next. Oh, Miss Willow, I think you will talk. Katja here, we'll see to that. We need you to come in. Are you kidding? I'm working. Barton's been compromised. 
Let me put you on hold. Where's Barton now? I'll brief you on everything when you get back. But first, you get the big guy. Hey, big guy. I, uh, assume the whole place is surrounded? Just you and me. Who are you? I'm here on behalf of S.H.I.E.L.D. We need you to come in. What if I say no? This has the potential energy to wipe out the planet. What does Fury want me to do, swallow it? It emits a gamma signature that's too weak for us to trace. There's no one that knows gamma radiation like you do. Just you and me. I got me one! I got me one! Good to go on this end. The rest is up to you. Stark Tower is about to become a beacon of self-sustaining clean energy. Sir, Agent Coulson of S.H.I.E.L.D. is on the line. I'm not in. I'm actually out. Sir, I'm afraid he's insisting. Gross fine, Jarvis. Levels are holding steady, I think. Of course they are. I was directly involved. Which brings me to my next question. How does it feel to be a genius? Well, <laughs> I wouldn't know that now, would I? Maybe you should ask that arc reactor of yours. Sir, the telephone. I'm afraid my protocols are being overridden. All right. Well, it looks like uh, it looks like we're doing just like that. So it looks like we're playing the. We started off with the Age of Ultron Avengers, but now we're going to go through the Avengers movie and then go back to Age of Ultron by the end of it. So, uh, looks like we've. Uh, Looks like Black Widow and uh, Hulk, Ho Hulk Hogan, <laughs> the Hulk have been uh, have been recruited, but now we're playing as uh, Tony Stark, the man in the red and gold himself, as we uh, have to answer the phone. Good job, Lego. No, I, I actually like uh, Lego's portrayal of a uh, story and uh, and just their little comedy bits that they add. They're a little like kind of a little niche to the uh, the game and everything. <laughs> I don't want to answer the phone. Okay, where actually where is the phone anyway? Oh, Shouldn't here we you go. answer that? It could be serious. Phil sounds pretty shaken. Phil? His first name is Agent. <laughs> Agent Phil Coulson. Okay, so there's one there. Actually, do I even need to do this? Or am I, or am I just doing it because I got caught up into it? Oh, I guess I was supposed to, I think. Actually, what, what does that A say? Is that for... <laughs> Only Tony can answer a star, uh, phone. Press B to pick it up. Okay, okay. Oh, do I need to go back to the computer now? Or am I... Okay, there it is. You have reached the life model decoy of Tony Stark. Please leave a message. This is urgent. Then leave it urgently. Security breach. Uh -oh. Mr. Stark. Phil, come on in. We're celebrating. Why is he here, Phil? Is this about the Avengers? Which I, I know nothing about. The Avengers initiative was scrapped. I thought, and I didn't even qualify. I didn't know that either. Yeah, apparently I'm volatile, self-obsessed, don't play well with others. That I did know. <laughs> okay, I guess we need Okay, well, anyway, I guess we need to talk to Phil. Okay, I'm done collecting uh, little bits and bobs. Let's talk to Phil and see what he has to say. Or do we have to switch to Phil? Oh, okay. Wh what's the objective? Do we have to... I guess we have to open up that. Alright, let's put together our... What we're talking about, I guess. Do I need to push it this way? Yeah. 
Okay, and I assume that's got to be Tony, or does Pepper? Does she can you? Does she actually have any abilities or powers? I know in the third movie she. Or, okay. Okay, I didn't do it like I was supposed to. Am I just supposed to keep pressing B? I think I am. There we go, okay. Anyway, I know Pepper in the third Iron Man movie has a big role in that one, so... But, anyway. We're not doing Iron Man 3, because this takes this movie takes place before Iron Man 3. So. Alright, let's put together what this is. Dot bam. Hey, would this be a uh, would this be a facial recognition or is this a Colson thing? Yeah, it looks like it's a Colson thing. All right. So Shield has their own grubby little. Okay. Maybe I have to use Pepper. Unless my B button's not working for some reason. It says a shield. Oh, I was about to say it says a shield agent, but Access oh, why wasn't why wasn't it working? Huh. Okay, maybe I just wasn't pressing it right or something. I need you to look this over as soon as possible. Official consulting hours are between eight and five every other Thursday. This isn't a consultation. What is all of this? I have no idea. Oh, okay. I oof, I wasn't paying attention to the uh, uh, to that little screen, so I don't know what I was. Okay, let's do that again. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, now that we paid attention. There we go. Come on. There we go. This is a, this. Poor Captain Steve Rogers. A man at a time. I mean, literally. Back when he first became Captain America, he had so many adventures and faced such incredible foes. I wonder if the future will be any different for him. Anyway, Cap had many strange adversaries, but none were as dangerous as the Red Skull and Arnim Zola. It's a good thing that he had help from Peggy Carter and his best friend Bucky Barnes. Alright, so the first, uh, first, uh, well, I guess everyone's being taken care of, but the first man on our list to, uh, be officially, or one of the many to be enlisted into the Avengers is Steve Rogers, which we've encountered at the beginning of this game. So, in the next episode of Lego Marvel Avengers, we'll encounter Steve, talk to, uh, uh, talk to Nick himself and find out what we need to do and how to get involved, or if we want to get involved. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next episode. Excelsior!